Hello, my little demons. I'm your host, Weeping Demon. Today, I will be giving you a tutorial on how to get your own Beat Saber songs because I've been having some people ask me how I got the song. So I'm going to show you so you can do it yourself because I'm nice. Number one, you need BeatSage.com. I will leave a link in the description. Number two, you will need YouTube with the video of your choosing. Just look up whatever song you want. Click it, get the link, and then what? If so, so let me show you how to do it. So you're going to want to control that, well, control C that, control V, and then you will be given the you will be given a whole cat the cast test thing. Blah, blah blah. Well, in my case, so once you get that, you get to choose any of your options. I personally like to have all difficulties. All of this and all of that, and then you slashed it. Oh yeah, and then also in advanced settings, you can choose. Well, number one, your environment. So I would choose. I I don't. I just choose default, and then you can choose V two, which is just sort of average. V two flow, better flow, less creative. So, you know, it feels better to play, but. You don't get as cool swings uh, because, well, you don't get as hard, difficult placements, so kind of easier. Then there's V1, more unpredictable but fewer modes. Personally, I just stick with either V2. I think one song I've done V2 flow. Then you slash to download. Slash to download. Then you wait. And we'll download. Just a minute. And then once it's downloaded, you show in folder, and you extract files. Uh, and then OK. Then you have the folder, which you will need to open another tab. Go to Windows. You click Program Files. You go to... Oh, wait, on which one did I click? I clicked, you go to Program M Files times 86. You go to Steam. And Steam Apps, Common. Then you go to, and then you would normally see Beat Saber here. Personally, it's not for me here, because I don't have installed on my main hard drive. So, it's not there. Instead, it's in my extended hard drive. So if you have an extended hard drive, you go to your Steam folder, Steam Apps, Common, and then here I have Beat Saber. And then you take the thing you had from Downloads, not that, you take the folder, make sure to copy it to Beat Saber, but then go into Beat Saber Data, and then Custom Levels, and it's there. So now you know something. And you know how to do it. I'd show you an example of me playing it. But. Uh, I don't have my headset on me right now. So. Anyways. Hope this helped you out. And I will see you all in the next video. Now you know how to play your own songs. You can do that with any song by the way. From either YouTube or SoundCloud. Or something else. Bye bye.